Hi guys, I'm getting ready to make some chicken pilau. What I have here, my pot, my pan is heating. Well, my pot is heating. I have two tablespoons of uh, oil in there, and now I'm going to add my sugar. This um, pan, for some reason, the middle is not flat, so all the oil just rolled off to the ed edges. So I'm just kind of going to spread it around like so. Okay, so now I'm just going to stir this around a little. Sugar is coming nice and caramelized, nice and brown. Sugar is getting nice and brown. I'm just going to stir. Give it a few more seconds or minutes, maybe. Then I'll add my, um, start adding the chicken pieces. Now this looks good. I'll give it a quick stir. This looks very, very good. Nice and brown. That's the color you I'm looking for in my pillow. I'm gonna start adding the chicken pieces. Give this a stir to make sure everything is nice and brown. Okay, be back. It's about 10, maybe 10 minutes, 10 12 minutes. So now we're gonna go in with our other type of seasonings. What I have in here celery, carrot, thyme, green pepper, pimento peppers, and um, red. Them, be, red on bell peppers. So now what we want to do, we want to stir, give this a quick stir around. Oops, I put this forward. Can't seem to get a good grip on my pan. Give this a good stir. I'm gonna cover for another 10 minutes. I'm gonna add the pigeon peas. I think I put too much of chicken in here because I only wanted to cook a, a cup and a half of rice, but now I guess I'll have to cook two cups of rice. Because it's a lot of chicken. I was meaning to save some. I just put it all. Okay, we're gonna bring that up and back up to a boil. Once it starts to simmer. Okay, I'm cooking this pale house similar to the way my grandmother used to make it. She used to put on um, cinnamon sticks. I've never done that. And bay leaves. So I'm adding some cinnamon sticks and some bay leaves. Devoting this pill out to my grandmother. So I will see if the cinnamon sticks and the bay leaf make any difference in the flavor. This is like the old time way of making pillow. is what our pan looks like now oh my gosh it smells wonderful it smells, smells like my my grandmother pillow only thing i'm going to be doing different i'm going to be putting coconut milk my grandmother never put um, she never put coconut milk in her pillow sometimes i make without coconut milk i'm adding my rice now and i'm using just a um 
This is a parboil rice. I think it's the best rice of pilau. I think it's the best rice of pilau. Tell you the truth. You know, I have a lot more stuff in here than rice, right? Chicken pilau. This is really a chicken pilau. But, you know, the rice has to, the rice will yield a lot. This is, uh, I believe, two and a half cups of rice in here. get everything going the only thing um, I'm adding extra in this is uh, as I said the coconut um, milk now I'm going to put uh, some seasoning this is some um, seasoning that I actually put together I'm going to add uh, two teaspoons My special seasoning that I that I mix, I create. <laughs> yeah, I think I'm funny, but I'm not. Uh oh, I better turn my phone off. Okay, so now we're gonna add some black pepper. Black pepper. I did add black pepper when I um, seasoned the chicken. So I'm just gonna put like a half a teaspoon in here. I don't need to add any more black pepper. Bring this together. But I do have, um, I love the color of this pillow. The, chick, the coconut milk is gonna change up the color. But I do have some liquid from where I boil the um, the pigeon peas. I have some liquid, so I'm just gonna add it in here. Probably have some, see? Some peas at the bottom. And right away, I'm gonna add the coconut milk. Just bring everything together. Now just let it cover and let it and cook. First, I'm going to add some, uh, some golden red butter. You don't have to add the golden red butter. And I can hear the haters now. You don't need oil. You don't need golden red butter. Okay. I hear you. But, say what? I like it. What is going to do? Tell me, okay. You all have to die one day. I may go sooner than you guys. Who knows? Or you may go sooner. Than you. Yeah, who knows? Let me just cook the food the way I like it. Let me enjoy my life and eat the food I like. If you guys don't like the golden red butter, leave it out. What can I say? I love it. So I'm just gonna cover this and let it simmer for about maybe 25 to 35 minutes until the rice is cooked. But I'm gonna put me a uh, hot pepper in there, only for flavor. Don't know what flavor it gives if it don't pop, but hey, that's what my grandma used to do. Put it for flavor, I'm putting it for flavor. So I'm gonna cover my pan. And we're gonna turn this on low and let it simmer away. And I'll see you guys back when it's done. Okay, I'm just having it. Let's take a peek at it. Peek at it. It's looking really good. So this is it, guys. So this is the pillow. It's done. Chicken is nice and soft. It's falling off the bone. Pillow is done. Yes. Pillow looking good. Look at this. Amazing. Very good.